All right. It's been a while since we've been on camera. Been doing a lot of shorts. It's been a hot summer. Haven't been really doing too much. Been 90s and 100s. Everything's just been growing. Well, this week fall hit fast. It was like 100 over a week ago. And then now we woke up this morning and it was 37 outside. So I think it's about time to start harvesting everything. So let's take a little quick walk through the garden and start the harvest. So I planted here some butterfly milkweed for the butterflies, monarchs. And then going over here into our garden, my garden. Got a lot of the blackberries still growing, still producing some flowers and some berries. We harvested one of Scotty's um, watermelon right here and we actually have another little guy. Let's see if he makes it. Some flowers, here's some corn Scotty grew. We have a bunch of corn to harvest today. Cucumbers are starting to die off. We've been picking those throughout the season. This guy actually, I missed him. He got stuck and grew in to uh, the wire. So he's just blowing up right there. Um, we got some ginger sprouting and growing right now. Those will probably go through the winter. A lot of tomatoes over here. This, I did not trellis them up, so they fell over into my walkway. So we'll clean those guys up. We have a bunch of carrots to pull out. Green onions, I'll just keep those guys going because they'll go through the winter. We come out every single morning and, and cut off some green onion for our scrambled eggs. Um, a lot of the lettuce we've been cutting and using for the chickens, for the reptiles, the tortoises. More lettuce, more lettuce. We had a pumpkin right here that we just cut. We got to trim up the uh, artichoke guys. And here is the asparagus that are still growing. And all the wildflowers. So... First thing I think I'm going to do is uh, clean up the tomatoes over here. I have these really cool kind I got this year from Baker Creek. I got a lot of cool Baker Creek seeds this year that I really liked. They're these guys. And they're, they're like a small medium size and they're called Pink Bumblebee. So you can see they have a, like a pink hue, little stripes to it. They're really good. Um, and then of course I have a ton of cherry tomatoes. so. Let's go ahead and get all those guys out, clean this mess up over here. So we've got a nice little kai kai. Nice little harvest of tomatoes. You can see these little pink bumblebee ones and a bunch of cherries. So they're still um, they're still growing out there. So I'll let them to let them continue to grow, and we'll continue just picking picking some off and eating them as we go. Little rock. There you go. Here, okay, Kai Kai. You want one? All right. Everyone enjoy some. Hmm. Oh nope. Rock doesn't like it. All right. Now I have my helper out here because he's excited to harvest corn. 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 I twist you. Get the corn out. So we have two types of corn over here. We have our glass gem corn and we have sweet corn. So let's check it out. Which one's that one? Rocky, don't eat that. Okay. I think it's a glass gem corn. You think it's one of our glass gem corns? Yes. What? You guess. I think you're right. Glassy. The glassy one. I see color in that one. Well, that's a purpley. It's purpley. Wow, that one has a lot of purple in it. Ew. Ooh, Ew. Look at that. Ew. One. Ew. Get off the hair off of it. <laughs> no, you can get the hair off. All right. Let's see. Let's keep going. Let's see what we got. We 
got some corn. Here's all of our harvest of our glass gem corn. Show him that one. Scotty's favorite is the little baby one. Yeah, yeah. No, my favorite is this one. Ha, 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 yeah, yeah. That's cool. Some of these are lighter colors. Some of these are darker. It's like this one's a lighter pastel. This one's a deeper, darker one. So we'll try to dry them out and uh, keep them as a. Poopy dotty! Cookie! Okay, what's next? Carrots! Carrots. Where's that? Right there. Alright, let's start. Get those guys out. I'm gonna do this one. Baby. Oh, these are some little guys. We didn't. <laughs> We didn't thin them out and we learned our lesson. They don't grow big when you don't thin them. Oh, look at this one! This <laughs> is a baby guy. Eat it. Oh. Eat it! Alright, let's see what this guy is. Boo! Alright, keep going. Let's see what this guy is. Yuck. Yuck. Whoa. What color is that one? We got some kaleidoscopes in here and some sweet. Wheat orange ones. That one looks like a yellow one. It is. Yep, it's a yellow. It's bigger well, than. Ooh, the... here's one of the. Yeah, I kill ones. you. What's the next one? This one. Alright. Orange. <laughs> Alright. My booty. Oh, dig out! Uh oh, gotta dig that one out. Purple. Look at that one. That one's like a red one. Cool. Alright. Okay. What else we got? Whoa. Boom! You eating a carrot fresh out of the garden? You good? Yep. Good. I think we got a lot of carrots here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think we got quite the carrot haul. But we're a lot more orange more. this year than our kaleidoscope from last year. Yeah. All right, so that's enough for my garden right now. I'm gonna still let things continue growing, but we got quite a bit out of it. Now I'm down here at Scott's garden. You can see we got a bunch of pumpkins growing down here. Big Macs over there. Pumpkins, pumpkins. And then we have all the gourds right here. You can see it growing. That's a weird gourd. Gourds. 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 These are where all the watermelons were growing. You can still see there's another watermelon right there. Some more pumpkins. And then over here we have some small decorative mini pumpkins. We already harvested a lot of those. But there's still a lot more growing. So there you have a garden update. Fall starts in three days. So garden slowly dying off, starting to harvest everything, and get ready for winter time. All right, we'll check back in later.